Mana Mission is a dream come true. Mana Mission is a ministry that provides a unique blend of effective evangelism, Christ-centered, compassionate medical care, and strategic community development. This has been a long childhood dream of Seth Ablor since his childhood at Quaymon and Teshi. The one who reinforced that dream was Ni Ajay Ali, Seth's grandfather, a prominent herbalist and fisherman. He always told Seth, when you grow up, you should be a doctor. Seth had promised his grandfather that he would be a doctor. A promise made to a grandfather, even when he was dead, could not be broken. The Lord opened doors for this African boy to go to the United States to study medicine. While studying at Oral Roberts University and later conducting his family practice residency at St. Elizabeth Hospital in Chicago, Illinois, Dr. Ablor shared his dream with churches, organizations, and friends. Three decades ago, that dream was birthed in Ghana, specifically at Teshi, where the Military Academy and the Kofi Annan International Peacekeeping Training Center are located. The Bible says a prophet is without honor in his own country. Mana Mission's concept of showing the love of Jesus in a demonstrable way met many obstacles in Teshi, but it prevailed. The groundbreaking ceremony for the establishment of Mana Mission was performed at Teshi Shriblo on a 32-acre donated land. It was on the 4th of July, 1988, when the late chancellor and evangelist Oral Roberts planted a cross and gave Seth to his people so he could be a blessing to many. Oral Roberts that day prophesied, saying, Someday we expect that there will be a great city in this place, a great hospital, a place where prayer and medicine is merged. A great spiritual revival will break out and the door will open through the gospel in areas where it has been closed. People will be healed, cured, saved, and filled with the Holy Spirit. The final event done by evangelist Oral Roberts was a parked crusade at the Accra Sports Stadium. It literally shook Accra. Those present included the Archbishop Duncan Williams, Benny Moon, Carlton Pearson, and the late Nigerian evangelist E. Dahosa. As prophesied by the late Oral Roberts, the revival sparked off in our Jerusalem, then to Judea, Samaria, and to the uttermost part of the world. Through large national programs like the National School of Ministry with Dr. Morris Krulo, crusades with Richard Roberts and Papa Billy Labanza of Zambia, the Living Mana radio broadcast, the Living Mana TV, and Ghana for Jesus Crusades. Mana Mission has touched a lot of lives in Ghana and beyond. These include Zambia, Tanzania, DR Congo, Gabon, Cameroon, Nigeria, Benin, Togo, Ivory Coast, Liberia, Sierra Leone, South Africa, Kenya, France, USA, and the United Kingdom. Mana Mission Church has grown from a small group of believers meeting at the reception hall of the old Mana Hospital building into a 2,200 strong and active member church with 20 branches. Mana Bible Institute has graduated 650 students. Mana Mission Hospital statistics for 30 years is as follows. OPD, outpatient department, visits 687,245. Admissions, 76,729. 13,502 babies delivered and 10,008 surgeries done. Mana Mission Academy has enrolled a total of 4,938 and graduated 303 students. Some of the junior high school's graduates gained admission to academically prestigious senior high schools in Ghana. These include Prosec Ligon Mfansisipim, Achimota St. Rose's Senior High School, Tema Secondary School, and Archbishop Porter Girls. Ebenezer and beyond. We thank God for bringing us this far, Ebenezer. We believe our best days are ahead of us. God has set open doors for us. I know your works. See, I have set before you an open door, and no one can shut it. For you have a little strength, have kept my word, and have not denied my name. Revelations 3 and 8. 
Our challenge is to forget the past. Do not remember the former things, nor consider the things of old. Behold, I will do a new thing. Now it shall spring forth. Shall you not know it? I will even make a road in the wilderness and rivers in the desert. Isaiah 43, 18 and 19. And focus on our future, according to Paul. Not that I have already attained, or am I already perfect, but I press on that I may lay hold for that which Christ Jesus has also laid hold for me. Brethren, I do not count myself to have apprehended, but one thing I do, forgetting those things which are behind and reaching forward to those things which are ahead. I press toward the goal for the prize of the upward call of God in Christ Jesus. Philippians 3, 12 to 14. We believe our God can do above what we ask or think. Now unto him who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we ask or think, according to the power that works in us. Ephesians 3 and 20. To God be the glory. God bless our homeland, Ghana. God bless Mana Mission. God bless us all. In Jesus' name, amen.